hello hello queens welcome and welcome back to my channel i'm kanisha with currency queen budgets i am a zero based cash budgeter on this channel i do all things budget diys plan with me's and so much more in this video i will be cash stuffing 402 dollars for december the 2nd 2022 if that is something you're interested in, stay tuned. All right, guys. So we are going to jump into this video. We're not going to waste any time. This bag can be found on my Etsy store. And the link will be down below as usual. How has everyone been doing? It is December. It is December, y'all. We only have a few more more days in this year that is crazy <laughs> um but yeah let's get this money counted i have 100 50 200 20 40 60 80 280 90 300 and 20 30 40 50 350, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 395, 396, 97, 98, 99, 400, 1, and 402 dollars. I am going to start with my bills. So in my bills, I am going to do, now I made a chart for my next year. This is what I need to stuff every week or bi-weekly in my things, in my envelopes. Um, credit cards isn't getting anything. I need to take this money to the bank too. Let me let y'all look at that. Yeah, I need to take that to the bank credit cards okay so i'm going to start with tides and i'm going to do fifty dollars for tides um car note insurance and cell phone isn't getting anything utilities will be getting thirty dollars yeah thirty twenty and thirty I'm just put that in there like that. And then rent isn't getting anything. Subscriptions, I'm going to do 10. Okay. Student loan, I will start stuffing that, but not this check. Collections, I already sent the uh, money off for the one that is due for this pay period. I already sent that money off. But I do need to stuff for next week, though. I'll do that in another video, probably. probably. Okay, so we will now go into my variable expenses let me fix my money right so i am going to do this i only got twenty dollars here hmm, i don't know what i can do with that Forty dollars, and these receipts will be uploaded into Fetch. If you don't know what Fetch is, Fetch is an app that you can download to your phone for free. You can scan any receipt that you receive from any store. It doesn't matter which store you're you are shopping at, but you will scan those receipts into the app, and those those receipts will accumulate 
points. And with those points, you will be able to redeem gift cards. They have gift cards such as Starbucks, Bath and Body Works, um, I think Hibbits, Amazon. They have so, so many um, gift cards that you can buy. But I have my QR code here on the screen. You can scan that or you can actually download it and enter my code, uh, which is also on the screen. And you will be able to receive points when you scan your first receipt. So, guys, please take advantage of that. It's just simple. Scan one receipt. Get your points. You get extra points for items that um, they might be having a promo on. I guess you would call it a promo. But certain items will get extra points. So, y'all, yeah, check that out and save that money. That is actually how I'm going to fund my Christmas this year. I am, I am only doing gift cards from the points that I have accumulated from Fetch. So, guys, yeah, try it out. Um, But we are going to get into my variable expenses. I am going to start with groceries. Let's see, I had nothing left over. Groceries will be getting $100. For my gas, did I have anything left over for gas? Oh, I did. Oh my gosh, I got $50 left, y'all. Do I want to leave that there? Or do I want to put it somewhere else? Oh my gosh, I can't believe that. Um, I don't know what I want to do. If I want to leave it or not. I don't, oh guys, what should I do? Leave it or no? I don't even know what I'm doing with this $40. I'm not sure why I even had that in my wallet, but um, yeah, but I got What shall I do? <laughs> I'm going to leave it there. I'm going to leave it there. Because I might decide to go take a little road trip. Take my daughter somewhere. <gasps> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Or I can go to Houston for um, Christmas. Do I want to do that? And just put a little extra more in there every... I don't know. But I'm just excited. So gas is going to get its normal $75. It's 50, 70, and 75. So I have a total of 125 in gas. I might decide to do something different with it later. I don't know. Because I do have a project that I want to work on. But I don't know. For right now, we're just going to let it be. Household. Okay, so household is getting $20. I think that kind of threw me off to know that I had that money still in there. Um, spending, it gets 10 For medication, I'm going to do five. And I don't think I stuck anything for copay. Yeah, I didn't do anything for copay. Yeah. So that is it for my variable expenses. I'm going to put this $40 back in here just in case I figure out what I'm supposed to be doing with this. Because I just had it laying there. I'm not sure. But we're going to sit that there before I jump into actually putting it somewhere else. Okay. So, for the remaining of this, let's count. I have 20, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95. I don't know why I'm laying this on my desk like this. 95. 
So I have $102 left over, and I am going to put that into my savings challenges envelope. Let me grab my binder. What did I do with it? Did I get it out? The safe or no? Savings Challenge Finder, so I am going to add money to my Savings Challenge envelope. And uh, let's see what we have here. Have two, four, six, eight, nine, and ten. Okay. So I have ten dollars in here. So that's a hundred and twelve dollars that I will be putting here. Why does gotta be all raggedy? All right. Let me see if I have some K-Books in there. I don't think I saw any. And I need to show you all my K box box because I think I just had it sitting here on my desk and I don't think I ever showed it to you all. It's simple, but as soon as I finish this, I'm gonna grab it. Okay, and then we will be doing my December savings challenge um, as well for this month. And I think I'm going to do that um, 530 days. I think I want to do that again for December. Okay. So that is that. Oh, my K-Books. So guys, here is my... Can y'all see that? Is it too close? This is my K-Books box. Can y'all see the sparkle in there? Y'all know I like shiny things, the glitter. But yeah, I just got a box and I put the K-Books on here just to put my K-Books in. And it's just a little slit up here and I actually just painted it and I did the back back there. Can y'all see that? I don't know if you can, but it's purple. But it's kind of cute. This video doesn't do it any justice. I don't know. If you guys can see that but yeah i thought it was kind of cute and it's kind of fun to make um but that is all that i have for this video that was quick and sweet and short um because i will be doing um some revamping with my budget so right now i'm not focusing on my sinking funds but i think i will be doing a stuffing for my sinking funds but that's not my focus for the end of the year. I'm really trying to focus on um, getting as much credit card debt that I can pay off. I can. I'm, I just want to. I don't want to go into 2023 with a lot of credit card debt. I want to pay as much as that off that I actually can. Um. So, I may or may not be stuffing that sinking fund um, binder for the rest of the year. I might just put it to the side. My um, sinking funds and my high priority, priority. So we will see how it goes for next week. I um, think this month is just focus on my credit card debt and as well as getting my savings challenges done. So we will try to see how that will actually work out for me. And oh, let me show you guys my nails, the blingage, the blingage. This is I call it my blueberry burberry. Isn't it cute, y'all? Y'all see the blink? Ah, so cute. I know y'all get sick of me. Y'all probably get sick of me and my nails, but I just be loving them because what I ask for, y'all, I get. And sometimes she goes above and beyond. But you guys know that I really appreciate you all for stopping by. Um, If you don't mind or if you already haven't, which I know you probably have, um... Go ahead and hit that 
like and subscribe button hit that notification bell and leave me a comment down below but you guys know i really appreciate it i appreciate each and every one of you for your support um but i'm not gonna hold you guys long but why do i keep saying but y'all know what it is y'all know i want you guys to be blessed queenies bye